as much as possible to enjoy yourself while making the meat. You don't have to be too serious and be too rigid. Always um, make room for like for suggestions because you don't know it all. No one is an island of knowledge. So if someone tells you to, okay, um, this kick is not sounding well, don't be too rigid. Uh, no, no, and I missed a big this thing fast. So you just listen because that might be what will change the whole sound. You can just try it out first. But if it's not cool, then you do what you are doing. You can remove it. But at least make room, allow room for, yeah, for. So I'll be showing you how I made um, the piece to work in my But I added another switch. Again, another thing. When you're making beats, yeah, you need um, all these FX, audio FX, like to show that something is, is yet yeah, the build up and the coming down here. Yeah, so when I made this beat, you know, I actually made this beat first. Then it was like I should play him something. I just played him this beat and it started vibing straight up. Any other question? Uh, Yes, now, you know, at first, you know, you have to make, like, the pre-chorus a little bit different from the verse, so, from the chorus, rather. So, for the pre-chorus, it was just the love drum. But for the chorus, I added the snare underneath it, so that it will, yeah. It's playing the same thing. But it still needed one more thing, you know, the, the impact. Yes, yeah, so that's it. When doing love drum dance, which one should be higher? Which one should be higher? I don't get it. The volume. Yeah, the log drum should be higher, obviously. Now, see, look at the volume here. I have to put this one down so that you feel the log drum. It won't be really nice. Uh, you can try it too. Don't let me say it won't be nice. You can try it. That might be your own style now. You can try it if it works for you. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Yes, a little. I can play the bass a little. That explains the saucy bass. Yeah. Yes, that's very important here. When I started, I started in school. So this was, let me just be practical. When I started, I didn't really know much, but you have to struggle your way. Meet your friends, start with your friends. After I the producer, come to my studio. From one person to the other, and make sure you do something good for the, when you do a nice job for him, he will tell his friend his friend will come. He do a nice job for that one too. You tell his other friend. That's how it seems. We just keep expanding and expanding and expanding. He gets. So that's basically it. From there, your work will start expanding. And make sure you work on yourself too and enjoy what you are doing. Or else you'll just be boring. And always keep things very simple. You don't need to be complex and because people listening are uh, yeah simple people they don't really understand music music so when you are doing too much what's this one doing but at the same time like maybe you should keep let me put it like this keep the complex things simple as simple as possible okay i think that that says it all hi guys it's your favorite producer nif keys and i'm at it labs music production training camp and guess what the experience has been quite exciting and entertaining i had to meet up with young and upcoming music producers willing to learn and know more about their crafts and trust me the experience was lit shout out to rexy for this he's doing a great job thank you very much <laughs>
I bet you I had a great experience. It was big. Like I was opportune to um, get um, lectures from big shots in the industry. And I bet you I'm coming big. Anticipate. Thank you. What's good guys, it's your Rexit on this one, Grammy Boy. Over the years I get hearing some artists all over the country, all in need of dope quality beats. But unfortunately I can't attend to all, so it's like more with the plan. We created an online Afrobeat shop called shop.islab.com. On this site, you get the chance to explore various Afrobeats on different genres. These beats are affordable and on fair terms. Dope quality beats produced by myself, and other dope producers on Islam Academy. So what are you waiting for? Keep exploring, keep creating good music. I remain your Rexy on this one. Your Rexy on this one.